And we come back to Dark and Rand's Mass Effect 3. Yay! Last time we discovered Morden has more songs in his, in, in his back pocket that we didn't know about. And now mm -hmm. we actually go back go back to work. So we can, yep. Because we can head to the Krogan DMZ, pick up a Shadow Broker team, go shoot some shit, and then go yeah. deliver some stuff to the Citadel. Let's see, the Dranak system over here. I found something. There we go. Got that. What's over here? Probably just debris. Yep. Okay. Hey, free fuel. I'll take it. Yeah, we weren't quite full yet after all. And one of these... Um, is it Arlac? Maybe? Has a rather funny backstory. Nope, not this one. Mm. Nope. Ah, yes. <clears throat> Durak is a small heat blasted rock lost in the blinding glare of the star Arlock. It occasionally traps a trace atmosphere of gases blown in on Arlac's powerful solar wind, which inevitably blowed, blows the gases back out again. The planetoid has few valuable loads of heavy metals, which were sporadically mined by the Krogan at the height of their power. In the closing years of the rebellions, the five clans working the planetoid fell to fighting over a particularly rich deposit of iridium. All five clan warlords agreed to a crush, a meeting at a neutral location, to negotiate a truce. Unfortunately, all five arrived, planning to betray their fellows. While the leaders and their seconds met, all their bases were destroyed by simultaneous hypervelocity cannon strikes. Left with only the food, water, and air in their hard suits, and no way to call for rescue, the warlords apparently fought each other to the death. The survivors of the five Durak clans on Tachunka still argue about which clan's warlord was the last one standing. Sounds about... And if I remember correctly... Uh, it's, it might, I might be misremembering, but I think Durak is Krogan for fool. <laughs> Makes or, sense. Or something similar to that. And good old Tachunka. Yep. In case you're wondering, it's still about as scenic as it was the last time we visited it. Wonderful. No, we can't even try to bring Rex here. Oh. Oh, well. Mm -hmm. Uh, Javik. Javik it is. Okay, I'm just gonna miss my thing, he says. I mean, yeah, he's easily the show stealer. Mm -hmm. Ooh, points to spend. Yes, but on what? Hmm. Mm, I guess I'll spend some on combat drone. Yeah, might as well. And turret. More survival over turret. And more damaging turret. Yeah, yeah. fair enough. Weapon damage is useful. You not level up. Uh... He, he didn't have enough points. Oh, okay. I used the arrows. So. Try to raise Lieutenant Victus. Yes, sir. For a Turian commander, what happened here is, let's just say the Turian code is not forgiving, and that it's his son is bad for the Primarch. Promoting family without merit can bite you in the ass. 
What's strange is the Primarch knows that. Commander, I have to land well back from the main crash site. That the best you can do? Yes, sir. But the Reapers seem unaware of our presence. You might get the jump on them. All right, set her down. Let's save this platoon. Yeah, that's a um, strange choice for someone as prestige that thing. Yes, but the connection is bad. Patch me in. This is Commander Shepard, Alliance Navy. Do you read? This is Lieutenant Tarquin Victus of the 9th Platoon. We're pinned by Reaper harvesters and taking heavy casualties. Also, there are pockets of my men scattered along the crash trajectory. <laughs> Lieutenant, I need you to fire a flare so I can find your position. There we go. Got it. Things get worse by the minute. My men are dying. This sounds bad. Let's move. Hello. A secretarian mission on Tachanka is especially hard. Thoughts? It doesn't matter. Our mission is clear. Not wrong. I don't think these guys are called for backup anyway. Yeah, they're just husks. Shame I don't have any good AoE abilities. Yeah, I, I guess most Garrus of you does. have <laughs> Fair enough. Right. Yeah, I guess Overload isn't exactly AoE. And the last one that you had? Fire blast or something? Yeah, but it wouldn't work as well. Ooh, money. You can always use more of that, right? Yeah. Escape pod. Our first casualties. Survived the crash, but then a harvester took out the pod. Died in the explosion. Or dragged out and eaten by husks. Hmm. Hmm. on the enemy, and there's an escape pod just beyond. Looks like the Turians are in tough. Enemies up ahead don't know we're here. Surprise on our side for once. I like it. Exactly. Let's go. Yeah, we don't usually get that chance, huh? Well, boss. Yeah, that was some unfortunate and uh, what's the word? Flipping? Yes, I don't know. Harvester! Incoming harvester! You're big. Fall bigger. Yes, uh, that is indeed a harvester. So would Overlord work against uh, the armor? No. In fact, Overlord does nothing to armor. Alright, Overlord was for shields, right? Yeah. Yeah, we haven't recorded in a while, so I don't remember some of those things. It would be kind of difficult to hurt those things, huh? Keep moving. There's ways. Find the main crash light ASAP. Well, yeah, of course they are. Being the name of Adrian Victus is a lot to live up to. It's a big military name on Paladin. War is expected to run in the Victus blood. War was a way of life for my people as well. If you couldn't fight the Reapers, you were left behind. Turian assault rifle. Well, we're not that nice. Yeah. And we're gonna go. Let's 
That works a bit better. Yeah. I guess you just have to aim it that it helps so it comes properly. Huh? Today I learned. Mouse wheel can change weapons. Huh. Hmm, makes sense. There's the harvester. So there it is. Would Cryoblast do something against them? Don't know. It's about living anyway. Yeah. Hey, 70 out of 100 melee kills, I think. Yeah. Yeah, you're not gonna be ticking that counter up this episode. I think we saved all those men. <laughs> this way! Not yet, at least. Shut up. I wanna have faith that I'll way. actually, you know, make a. How did you. <laughs> did you say you told me what you were on Roku? Oh boy, a new armor you're not gonna use. Smart show. I'm not sure what that does, bro. I'm not sure we'll find out eventually. Uh, it narrows the spread so it's more accurate. Oh, that's probably useful, yeah. Good morning! The man who it's from. They won't be needing it anymore. You know, harvesters have cannons in their faces. So it seems. Cryoblast! Yeah, when I'm not in cooldown. Oh, it does it share a cooldown with... Yeah, everything, or... everything has cooldown. Oh, no, everything has cooldown. That did not seem to do much. Oh, well. Ah. No, except get me to take fire. To be fair, you mostly took fire when you were at shooting. Man, that Harvester has it out for me. Yes, that is us. I mean, I can't say I blame you. It's definitely the bigger threat. Yeah, I like that. Fuck off. <laughs> yeah, <you're chilling> <laughs> Fuck off. Fuck off. Okay. Let's pick it up. It's important we don't lose this squad. To hold the Krogan vaccines unproductive, all available forces should be mobilized against the Reapers. Krogan Turian animosity is ancient and intense. It's in more. And I need them to work together, so let's not complicate things. That yeah. is not the button I wanted to hit. Ding! That doesn't count. <laughs> hey, maybe yell. That's useful. Give. There we go. Ooh. Oh, well, there's people down there alive. What? We were so great. I was looking at a better, at a better sniper. All right, let's That's just a piece of a sniper. Well, a sniper ugly, really. 
Yep. Well, hello there. You're technically translated to a better sniper. Brute. Indeed. Get down. Because apparently I can't climb over that cover like I want to. So you would see. Nine hundred out of a thousand total kills, I guess. Look, I can't help but notice such a nice popping. Even if you haven't even actually gotten them yet. <laughs> Where's that other mark? There it is. Okay. I'm not quite tempted to actually get the legendary edition. Still would need origin. Yeah, that's the main problem why I don't want to. Oh, you're out of ammo. Not a problem. Yeah, you switch weapons. You have enough powers that you could probably just win any fight even if you didn't have ammo. Where's the fun in that? I didn't say it would be fun, I said you could. Woo! Also try not to get killed. I can assure you it's not in my plan. Oh, he's just rice. No, what he's doing is he's reinforcing the ones that are alive. Oh. Makes them tougher. If only we had Chiquita here. Oh boy, another one. Or maybe one we had already. Yeesh, do they ever stop? I'm trying to pick something up. something else. Oh. Um, fuck. What? The harvester Nothing. took exception to me. So it would seem. Oh no, we're gonna have to. Yeah, I mean, I guess it was just one continuous fight. Did you just pull a Liera? Uh oh. Uh -oh. Dead. Yes. You even got it a few extra safety shots, huh? Yeah, it's I'm, not not, not, I'm still not exactly sure what was that thing you picked up. We'll get there. I'm most definitely gonna use it on the harvester. Oh, it's a heavy work on this entity. Yep. But this is the strongest game. It's about as close as we're gonna get in this game. That's both interesting and disappointing at the same time. Sorry to interrupt meal time, but this is a battlefield. <laughs> Get off of this cover. This cover is bad. Yeah. Especially when the harvesters decide to take exception to you. Oh, 
Twitch. Oh, you can get decimated really fast. Uh, yeah, it's basically anti-material weapons. That's basically a dropship and a gunship combined for the, for the Reapers. Yeah, fade them off. Hey, buddy. Fuck off. Yeah, that works. So yeah, it's well, basically the cane for this game. Well, that's one less harvest then. Saving so many. What happened here? He screwed up. Stand down, soldier. He's better dead because of him. I said, stand down. Hey, I just saved all your asses, so everyone just calm down. Lieutenant, what's going on here? I made a bad call. This is all on me. I chose caution and clever tactics over a head on attack. And. My men paid the price. You mean the crash? Yes. We could see on Hollow that Reaper forces were blocking our intended path. Staying on course guaranteed heavy casualties. So I chose a safer route, skirting the enemy. And that took us low and through these ruins. When we encountered resistance, there was no room to maneuver. Suddenly, we were in a fight for our lives. A lot of my men lost that fight. Owning your mistake takes guts. But you have to get over it and move on. Of course. It's just fresh right now. Our mission's still a Yeah. When we've stabilized the injured, we'll head back to the fleet. You're abandoning your mission? We're down over 30 men. It'd be suicide. What exactly did you come here to do? There's a bomb on the planet. We were sent to defuse it. A bomb? How big? Enormous. Cerberus has it. Lieutenant, if Cerberus has that bomb, you have to finish your mission. Haven't these men sacrificed enough? I understand. This kind of sacrifice is the hardest to ask for, but your men signed on for it. And so did you. My men have lost hope, Commander. Even if I wanted to finish the mission, they don't. It's your job to make them want to. How? Their sacrifice means that others will never face what they faced here today. Remind them that those sacrifices have no honor if the mission fails. Men, I own what happened here today, but we have to carry on. No, we don't. Who cares about a few dead Krogan? It's over. We are Turi, and we will not let Cerberus succeed. Our sacrifice is the difference between life and death for this entire galaxy. Let the heroes of the Ninth Platoon be remembered for performing their duties with bravery. All right, men. Shuttle's arriving any minute. We're moving out. Well, Commander, come with us. We're a shell of what we were. It's uh. We could use the help. Send me the nav point. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. That'll give us time to do a little recon. See what we're up against. Victus, could be bad, bro. Could be worse. Make their sacrifice count. Yeah. Understood, Commander. Hope to see you at the rendezvous. He's getting off his ass and improving, so that's already mind. something. What the hell is going on, Commander? And what do the Turians have to do with it? Coordinates Victus gave me place it in the Kelphic Valley. It's a heavily populated area. That's all I know. My gut says something's not right here. What do you suggest? Get the Primarch to come clean. Should we alert the Krogan military? I'd wait. We're in the dark here. Krogan Turian relations are fragile until the genophage is cured. Let's not push it. And how about this bomb? How many troops does Cerberus have on this? No idea. All I know is we can't have them detonating that bomb. Indeed. Hack it out. Primarch Victus. Impressive work on Tuchanka. I'm grateful that. Why didn't you tell me about the Cerberus bomb? Why hide that? 
What else are you keeping from me? I have nothing for you. For our alliance to work, I need to trust you. Our friendship is new, Commander. Would you trust me with information that puts your people, puts Earth, at risk? Why would I jeopardize our alliance by lying to you now? Doesn't make sense. Decisions like these weigh heavy on me. When I was a general, I could pass them up the chain of command. But now, I'm all I've got. Know what I mean? Sure. And? And... And that's all. Wait, there is one more thing, Commander. Thank you for saving my son. We need something. Shepard, test verified. Results promising. Can synthesize for universal Krogan immunity. Good. Then you can put your knife away. The cure's ready? No. Still need transmission vector. Cure useless unless given to entire species. You're usually full of ideas, Morton. You altered the genophage before. There must be a way. Of course. Always possibilities. But time limited. Can't create new infection strain from scratch. Groundwater? No. Too slow. Voluntary inoculation risky. Population too scattered for airborne. Unless... Wait! Yes! The Shroud. Constant global dispersion of air particles. Built by Salarians to repair atmosphere of Tuchanka. Also used by Turian. We used it to secretly spread the genophage virus. It ended the Krogan rebellions. I'd be careful who you tell that to. Sometimes I understand why the Krogan want to shoot everyone in sight. Those were desperate times. Yes, yes, but useful now. Original genophage strain still in storage at Shroud Facility. Can use it as transmission vector. Then you Shroud to blanket Tuchanka with cure. You clever little piejack. That's our best shot, right there. Then finish your preparations and be ready to go, Morton. Of course. Ready when you need me. We'll be in Medbay with Eve until then. Nice. Meanwhile, the war marches on. System lost, more money. And, yeah, boom. Priority to Chunka. So many updates. You yeah, know, just a few. Anyway. Distress call. For oh boy. Specialist trainer had discovered a weak signal being broadcast from a region close to the Citadel. After analyzing the signal, Specialist trainer and I agree that it is a distress call. This would not normally warrant your attention, but there have been reports of pirates using distress calls as a tactic to raid c uh, passing ships. CSET claims they do not have the men to spare to investigate. If you wish to look into this, then I will add the coordinates to the galaxy map. Sure. And as well. <clears throat> Garrus. Shepard, I tried asking around about what a Turian team would be doing on Tuchunka, but didn't get anywhere. Either they don't know or won't say, but whatever it is, it's big. While I was asking around, I did hear about some of our assault troops that could use our help. They're pinned down defending a colony in Volus territory. They know what they're doing, but they're not going to hold out forever. The way this war's going, we need all the help we can get. True? Yeah. Hmm. Volus territory, huh? And Liara, hmm. about the wet team we just got. Oh, yeah. Shepard, I've already dispatched most of the specialists we recovered to new assignments. I do need the Solarian Tazic and his small team to handle a task from the Citadel. Please make sure they remain confined to the cargo deck. I do not want them anywhere near me or Glyph. Hmm. Interesting. So apparently we have a just a Shadow Burker wet team on the ship right now. Yep, Shadow Burger wet team. That's funny. Okay. Can we go like talk to them or something? Mm, possibly. So there's that. And then that's the main yep. quest over there. Mm -hmm. There's actually one other mission on Tachunka that I guess just won't show up until we, uh, we do the bomb ship. Bomb mission. Yeah. Probably. Uh, yep. Shatterbroker wet team. 
And they probably mm. have... Do you, do you fucking mind? Do you fucking mind? <laughs> they do work for the shadow, bro, Kirasteros. Hmm, nothing to say. Briefing. Charles Sorrento, human politician. Location. Tesseri Ward, Citadel. Gather information and eliminate. Dossier. The human oh. politician has arrived in the Citadel and staying with extended family. A small window of opportunity is available to be exploited. Target has access to offshore accounts provided by Cerberus. Obtain target and extract information regarding purpose of Cerberus funding. Leverage compliance with family if necessary. Eliminate the target post-questioning. Minimize collateral damage to civilians. Family and associates are considered le legitimate targets. Payment made upon completion. Man, Liara got merciless. Yeah, admittedly, you know, dealing with Cerberus right now is not okay. Is it yeah, ever? You get close to the model. Is it ever? I mean, it wasn't the second game. I wouldn't say it was okay, even in the second game. We dealt with them, kinda. Not like we wanted to. Parts of the chunker reminded me of the desert. Yeah, you know. The lizards and worms are bigger, but, you know. But still, like... <laughs> no, at least funny. Severus was somewhat decent at the time. Primark's son is in over his head, no? Rachni? Of all the things that... It's like you got the opposite of a horseshoe up your ass. <laughs> okay. Grunt is crazy. than that you, even? And that's saying something. You're better than... <laughs> You're better looking at least. Hey. Okay then. I mean, yeah. Shepard, thanks again for being there at the refugee memorial. I feel better. Everything's so much clearer now. Glad I could help. I can't believe Cerberus would open fire on civilians like that. As twisted and insane as his logic might be, I thought the elusive man was trying to save humanity. I guess he's willing to sacrifice anyone to win. Doesn't hurt to go over the weapon roster one more time. Sir. Sure. We'll just roll up a deck and see what, uh. Oh no, wait, damn it, I miscalculated. We wanna go talk to Javik. Javik yeah. is yeah. over here. Yeah, but kissing the death crow. You should not have let the Turian soldier evade his responsibility. I take it Protheans didn't forgive any mistakes? If he had been under my command, I would have marooned him in the desert, buried him in sand up to his neck, and let the wildlife feast on his eyes. If he survived that, I would have rewarded him by shooting him in the head. Good soldiers are a precious resource. The stupidity of one cannot be allowed to jeopardize the lives of the others. The Turians are hiding something, Commander. Be careful. Tuchunka was not always a wasteland. It once had jungles and forests. Scary thought, huh? <laughs> the Krogan didn't need the Reapers to destroy their world. They did it on their own. Such a foolish race. I am with my own thoughts. I am with my own thoughts. Guess that's oh, him what? saying, uh, I got nothing else for you. Ah, like Garros' calibrations. <laughs> Not sure what to think about that little mech dog roaming the ship. You mean Sophie? I think she's cute. What purpose does she serve? I guess I have a Sophie. soft spot for working with dogs. Look how long I've been with you. <coughs> <coughs> Fucking Ow. savage. <laughs> Which one's Sophie, though? Uh, she actually isn't showing up, but, uh... Um, there's supposed to be a uh, little, uh, like, you know the little attack mech dogs? Basically what looks like that, uh, but a smaller version, just kind of walking around a shuttle bay. Huh. It was supposed to belong to one of the uh, retrofit crew, but uh, it got left on the ship, you know, when Joker and Edie said, Okay, we're leaving, guys, bye. Yeah... Are dead in the Central Asian wilderness, even more in Sub-Saharan Africa. 
We'll give you the gruesome view of what happens when the Reapers don't stop to indoctrinate. Now, in the battle space. <laughs> yeah, like if if, the, if it's on the ship, you, one of the first emails you get is actually from the owner saying take care of her. Mm. Commander. And you have nothing for me. Maybe. Yeah, that must be a difficult story to... Yeah, well, she's, she's got to be good for something. Yeah, I mean, it is her job. Just, you know, feel sad. Yeah, well. Alright, what are we doing now? Find the bomb. Bum, bum, bum. Sorry. No, you aren't. No, I'm not. Keep the same team. Yeah, might as well. We can probably bring Solus onto the Xenophage cure thing. Just because I feel it would make sense. He's not even on the list. Oh. Morden is not on the list of characters we can bring. Alright. No pressure. Yeah, you know, minor really does. Get behind something. Right. Does that something include Commander Shepard? <laughs> well, also, staying still is a. Not advisable. You notice all those explosions everywhere? Mortars. They can hit you. They almost did just there. <laughs> Ultra Instinct Shepard intensifies. <laughs> yeah, like that wasn't even on purpose, but... Oh, now you're... Now you're losing HP. Quickly. All according to Kiko. Are you ready to take? There we go. Find the right power. Give him something else to shoot at. Useful, but nice. Yeah. It's more levels for the sniper, I guess. Shepard has breached the perimeter. The correct response to that is, well, we're fucked. Basically. I don't think they don't need kids anymore. That wasn't a grenade. That was a turret. I don't oh, have. Oh, someone. I, I don't right, someone has to do that grenade. I was say, remember, I don't have grenade, I have turrets. Yeah, and drones. But they're very nice. Hi there. I just, I just slipped past that trooper. Bing! Shut up, you. <laughs> oh, hello there. Oh, my. What's over here? More armor, you're never gonna use. Gotta catch them all. 
Yeah. Dang, I don't want to target him. I want to target him. Well then, that was a pleasant little uh, firefight. Yeah, I mean, it hasn't gone too bad. We defeat the Krogan and then plant a bomb on their planet. Pretty extreme, but those were desperate times. A cunning strategy. Control your enemies without them knowing. Way to do it. I still prefer the more high caliber snipers myself, but yeah, but I'm not I can much. See the in that one. Yeah, but you know, I've never barely been much for the one shot type of gameplay. Yeah, that's definitely more my shtick. Just... Oh. They're prepping for evac. And that's not exactly good given the circumstances. Yep. That probably means they are dead. I was about to say, that means it's time to move faster. Detonation protocol complete. Oh no. Really? I hate it when I get caught on scenery. Oh, hello there. <laughs> that, shuttle, mean does a lot of damage. that shuttle just like, well, they're all dead. I'm leaving. <laughs> and yeah. Yeah, but they're pro yeah, but they're definitely gonna double back and try and stop us from disarming it. Yeah, probably. Cerberus is not very well known for self-preservation. They might come in handy. Yeah. We need to hurry. Deal with them. That looks like the Cerberus set up a firewall around the trigger mechanism to slow us down. I need to create a bypass. That'll take time. But like you said, no trigger, no explosion. Are you sure you can disarm the trigger? Yes, it's old tech. I know what to do. Buy me a few minutes, Commander. We'll make sure you have the time you need, Lieutenant. Understood. Starting bypass. And thank you for making sure I get this chance. Just make it right, soldier. Look out! Commander! Focus on the bomb. We'll handle Cerberus. He's shooting. There is someone sniping. And they just conveniently decided to go for the least important targets first. And, you know, like, 
with super precise strikes that could have hit anyone anytime. Yeah, it's like shots that were able to one shot those guys through their shields and armor and just. Yeah, we're just gonna go for the moon. It's like. I'm just gonna just casually snipe their necks. Why is my mouse being so sensitive? You can see it wobble when it, sometimes when I shift. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, probably not as fast as my gamepad. <laughs> I wanted to smash your face in. That delayed melee, though. I like that you can use powers while in a scope. Yes, that is. Well, let me see. Oh. Boy, motherfucker. Ding! No, that hit. It just didn't kill. That was a centurion. Firewall's down! I'm in. Spirits! Cerberus hacked the trigger mechanism. It's set to detonate. Disarm it! No time! I have to separate the trigger from the bomb. Now! Cover me! Never mind it, I'm firing more from that magazine that's actually in it. I don't believe this. When you have done that first, because it's kind of dangerous. Uh, Better to just remotely disarm it. Uh. And because sometimes things break. Well, the Admiral is not gonna like that. Primark? No. Yeah, 
think you'd be the guy who told the Krogan about that surprise package. Did you get out all right? It sounds like it got ugly down there. The Turians took a lot of casualties, Joker. The Primarch's son included. Understood, Commander. Joker out. He never hesitated. Whatever he was before, he'll be remembered for this. What will the Turians think about this, Garrus? Hard to say. Sacrifice and more is expected. He did us proud, but we're a hard bunch to please. Living your life for the cause. Society first, platoon first. It's all just expected. He did what he had to do when it counted. Yes. Yes, he did. Yeah, that's still not an easy thing to... Good work on Tachunka, Commander. Stopping that bomb prevented the war between the Turians and the Krogan. We can't afford that kind of division right now. Joker said the Krogan are recovering the bomb. They moved in, won't allow Turians to send in recovery crews to help. Understandable. The situation is fragile at the moment. With Rex and the Primarch aboard the Normandy, you've got a situation brewing. We don't have a solid alliance between those two yet. Keep the peace, Commander. That's an order. Yes, sir. Pack it out. We couldn't risk another galactic war with the Krogan. The Genophage wasn't enough? You had to plant a bomb on my planet? The decision was made hundreds of years ago. So much has changed. Not enough to tell us about the bomb, coward. Hey! We can't let the past rip us apart. Working together, we have a chance. Primarch, you had a bomb on Tachunka. And Rex, in the Turian's place, you would have done the same damn thing. Shepard. It's over. His own son died today, making this right. Please, Commander. It's all right. <clears throat> yes, fine. Shepard, you make your point. We have stronger enemies to face. We do. <clears throat> I understand your reservations before, Commander. But I hope you now understand the secrecy. Secrets get people killed. You've learned that the hard way. Yes. The hardest lesson I'm ever to learn, Commander. Yeah. You could say. son. He died with the respect of his men. I wanted to thank you for that. His sacrifice will be recorded in the histories of the Ninth Platoon. Something any father would be proud of. Yes, sir. You're lining, I guess. Still painful as fuck. Yep. There it is. Alright, so what's new in the mail? Er, not grunt. No subject. Oh, uh, boy. Uh, yeah, I'm not even going to try reading that. <laughs> That's a good fight, Shopper. You can <laughs> hear him, but I've got her like company shutting Shopper. Shopper. <laughs> Your name, you know? <laughs> I should have some rancor to heal my one shirt of rancor. <laughs> Where are you, shipper? Rapper, shipper. <laughs> you ever wondered how it was just a, like, a voice, voice to text recording? <laughs> or Grunt took the time to type that out while <laughs> drunk, off his drunk off his ass. In one way or another, he, he was drunk off his ass. Whether he did voice to text or typed it. Uh, that, that, that had to be typed because of the misplaced punctu pun punctuation. I'm good at English. Yeah. Meanwhile, Jessica Fromm. 
Dear Commander Shepard, my name is Jessica Frome. You saved my life on Benning. I've lost so many friends and artists, but I find hope in the idea that their memory lives on in me. I know I'm just one woman, but I wanted to let you know you're making a real difference. So one of those civilians we rescued. That's nice. That's nice. <laughs> Alright, so the things remaining to do... I want to wait long time. Back, I'm getting there. Way. Is investigate the yeah. Cerberus attack, because Cerberus still hasn't had enough at Tachunka. Really? And then... Make a bunch of deliveries and hit the shroud facility. Yep. Easy, no? Yep. So we'll do all that next time. Next time. Bye bye.